Okay, this is a quick instructional video showing you how to use this, the below the crimp tool that we sell with the part number PPPOL1928. We've had a few customers reporting that they're having a little bit of difficulty getting it working, so we thought we'd make this video to help. Now you'll need a few things. First of all, you need some wire. Um, this is 26 AWG. You'll need some wire strippers, some crimp pins. Now these are the female crimp pins with the part number PPPOL1930, but they're also available in male, which has got the part number PPPOL1931, and some connector housings. Now the first thing, you need to get your wire strippers and your wire, and you want to strip off around about 5mm of the insulation there. And then what you need to do is twist the end so it's nice and straight, just like that. Next, you want to take your crimp pin. Now to remove these, what you do is you rock them back and forth like that until they come away. Now you want to hold it at this end, you can see that. Then you take your tool and let's see if I can get this in shot here. Offer it up just like that, and you want to have it recessed by around about one mil, and then one, two, three clicks just to hold it. Now, if you can see here, this little bit here, you don't want this to be in there because you don't want to squash that just like there. Then you take your wire, pop it in just like that, and you can see just there you don't want the plastic part of the insulation to come through, and then crimp down and release and you can see there one crimped pin now you take the housing and you can see the chamfer side here that's the actual female end so you don't want there this is where the pin goes and you can see you've got a little spring latch type bit there and your pin pops in until you hear a little click and job done and that is how you use the crimp tool from Prolulu, available at protopic.co.uk. Thanks.